Hello and welcome to part 28. So today we're going to be doing a section that's round about the middle of the ship and then we're going to be starting work from the back of the ship working forward. Um, I'm going to start moving in a minute and there is a section I just want to show you that it looks like we've missed by accident but we haven't. We'll come back to it because that's where the pool is going to be, the iconic pool. Um, but there's some bulkhead adjustments that we need to do, so I've saved it for last. So that section there, this little one that we're flying over right now, we're going to come back to that one. As you can see, I've marked it out with some red because it needs adjusting. So this is the one we're coming to. So it's between the last funnel and the middle funnel. So this is where we're working today. So, we'll start on the left. Obviously you want your smooth quartz block. Obviously I've already pre-done the windows as well. So make sure you don't forget those. So from this corner here, you're going to go to the right by 8. And then on the ninth block do that. 6 forward, 7, 8, 9, 10 forward. 3 to the right. One forward, and then a door, and then two. Right. And then from this block to the sixth one, you want to then go two to the left, two forward, one left, and then a door. One, two, three, four, five. So you should have that. Okay, and then from this block here, five to the right, two back and then a door to the right there and then three and just take that back there two forward we should have that and that is going to be vent units I think that said and then stewards accommodation so from here seven and then a door, and then one there, and then three back, and then three to the right, a door there, and then one block, and then forward, five I think that was, four to the right, two back, a door, and then one there, and then just go across there like that, that's a linen closet, one there, a door, and then one what you should have. <sighs> right. I think we're going to deal with the staircase next. So from this corner here you want a two block gap and then four there like that and then a stair block and then another line and then a stair block and another line. It's up to you what block you use for your stairs. Uh, I think for the most part I've been using oak stairs really. One, two, three, four, five. Then back one, it's going to be a door. And then four there. And then one there, a door. And then two. Two back. Two to the right, a door. Then two. Then nine forward. Just like that. And we'll just deal with this little bit here. So from this corner, you're just going to put two there and two there. Just like that. Pretty weird shape, but there we go. So from here, you want one block, a door, and then one. Double it. And then facing this way, three block gap, and then a stair block there. And then a line there. Like I said, it's up to you what you use for your stairs. If you want to use quartz, it's up to you. <laughs> right, from this block, you want to go six forward, and then a, a door block there. <laughs> Neil said stairs. Okay, and then three there, like that. Two back. 
and then two to the right, two back and then two to the right and they're going to be little cubicles if you've not guessed it already. And then from here just finish that off. So you've got a, a couple of cubicles here as well. Just like that. Just a little bit more to do now. Right, so from this block here, four back, four to the right, two back and then a door there, and then two here, and then finish that off there. You've got a couple of cubicles there as well. And just finish this bit off. So from this middle block here, four, and then a door to the right, and then one, oh, door to the left, sorry, and then a door to the right again. And then going to be baths, and this is going to be stewards lavatories, or shitters, or pisses, or whatever you want to call them. Right, I think that is pretty much the layout now. So uh, we'll transition off, uh, build it in and uh, give you a quick show around. Right, so there we go. So we'll start here on the left. So obviously accommodation. Got some beds in there. And a couple of wardrobes. Howling wolf style. So that's that. And obviously don't forget your windows. And obviously there's nothing through there. It's just a bit of a passageway really. Uh, in here, we really did not know what to do. <laughs> it says vent units. We really didn't know what to do, in all honesty. There weren't any pictures we could find, so it's you could try and design mm -hmm. something yourself. Sorry about my phone, then. So a bottle room. I'm guessing that's where they store bottles, so... Yes. And then uh, shelves through there. Linen cupboard. So, that's that. And uh, just some shelves in there. Just had to make a quick cut in the audio because I decided I wanted to sneeze. There was nothing I could do about it. <laughs> it was coming and I'm guessing you didn't all want to hear it. Oh, coffee. Thanks. I like my coffee. So you got your shitters in there. Shitters in there. And then you guessed it. Shitters in here too. And uh, that is pretty much the layout. It's empty in there. If you want to put some decorative things in, in your corridors and stuff, it's up to you. It's your ship. I do encourage you <laughs> to decorate it better than I do. Obviously, I'm I'm having to push the tutorial out, so I don't want to be spending all day decorating things. So I encourage you to uh, decorate yours, though. But yes. That is pretty much it. Obviously when you're filling this in, fill the deck in, just make sure you go around your staircases. And uh, yes. So it's time to fill this in. So that was section 12. I actually should have shown that off at the beginning, but I didn't. It was section 12. Obviously section 12 isn't actually going to exist anymore. Because we've just covered it, so... Eventually we will redo the signs, to be honest. When we've levelled the ship out, uh, we'll we'll go through it again and uh, redo the... Uh, excuse me. Redo the, um, the signs. God, I can't speak. Oh, someone decided to do Phil. Thank you very much, whoever did that. Obviously... Doing a faster job at what I was doing. Look at all those things they've been throwing down at me. And they wonder why they wind up in prison. This is a prime example of why they wind up in prison. Because they cannot behave themselves. So it's not just me being a meanie. So that's d deck. So that's all levelled out now. So obviously the work we're going to be doing... Uh, in the second half of this video is from the back so we're going to be working from the back moving towards the front of the ship and the last thing we will deal with will be the uh, the pool area 
and uh, then the ship will be leveled out then so yes that's that for the first half so I will be back in a moment and we'll start from the back so we're at the back of the ship now uh, so like I said we'll be working our way forward from this point for the next few videos we're going to be working from the back so you want to come to this very first section at the back here where you've got this bit so you've got that bit there and then down into this one which is just above that nether out there is going to put some cargo in that's going to be G deck so it's just some cargo in here nothing special has pre-filled it just to save some time now once you've done that you can just fill in the deck it's nice and simple So yes, while we, we do this, I'll explain why the, the pool is being left for last is because we need to make some adjustments to the bulkheads to uh, accommodate the size of the pool uh, because that was not taken into consideration when the bulkheads were put in. So there's just a slight adjustment on two of the bulkheads back there just to uh, accommodate the pool. And I feel like, it probably isn't, but I feel like it's going to be a pain in the arse. So I've left it for last. It should be uh, easy enough though, I think. I just wanted to get the rest of the ship out of the way first, really. So that's that bit done. And uh, we'll move on to the next bit now. So we're in the same section that we were in before. Um, but uh, as you can see, something has been marked out. And that is the steering gear. Now I did work off pictures of this, I've tried to get it as close to it as I could. Um, in reality it was a lot wider than than this, but uh, obviously it's limited space, it's Minecraft, what can you do? So where these are here, you're just going to put a bit of a wall there, that's it. Just uh, round that off there. So two blocks from the wall piece, you're just going to do a bit of a wall just levels it off okay and then you're going to grab polished deep slate slab and you're going to do two there two there and two there and then you're going to go down one and do another six and then you're going to go down one again so you've got two three four five six seven i think that is so you got one in already two three four five six seven so it's eight altogether i think i think that was seven across i think so it should be nine across all together and then five forward and then just do another line there and then you're going to go one up and then you're going to do six and then one up again and then do another six so you should have that for now okay so this pink is going to be smooth sandstone so you one two three four five so you've got row five there so you're going to do six rows of five all together. No, seven, sorry. Yeah, seven rows of five with the sandstone. Obviously, I'm trying to work within the uh, the marking out. You don't have that problem. So seven rows of five. Okay. And then from the middle here, four back with the sandstone so you should have that without the additional marking out of course then you're going to grab sandstone stairs put one there and then one there so four steps all together and then one on top of that block there just like that one in the middle and then you're going to do four stairs on the side again just like that and then one there 
and then you're going to do a bit of a ring around this bit just like that and you should have that for now all right so back to the smooth sandstone so in between these steps here you're going to do two so that's two three four five so five rows of two there we go and then the cut sandstone slabs across the top there just like that And then you're just going to fill the middle in here. So that's that. And then you're going to grab the polished granite stairs. Do two there. And then stairs. Three there. Two there. Two there. And two there. And then a full block in the middle. And then uh, the sandstone wall in the middle there. And I think, unless I've missed anything, that's it for that. So you're just going to do bars across here. Now obviously they're not all going to be touching because of the, the fact that it slabs. <coughs> Excuse me. But uh, there was a bit of a walkway around this thing. Uh, like I said, <coughs> excuse me. in reality it was a lot wider. Uh, there was a lot more detail to it. But... Um, it's Minecraft. What can you do? <laughs> so that's the steering gear. So that's all sorted now. So that's good. So obviously the only thing left in here now really is a, a staircase. And that's about it. <coughs> Sorry, I feel like my voice is going. Right, so from this corner here you want a one block gap. And then you're going to do three. Just like that. And then another five there. And then the same on this side. And then obviously it's going to be a staircase going up. So I'll just bring the walls up. Remember to bring them up one block higher than you uh, usually do your walls. <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe a sip of coffee will help. It seems to have done the trick. <laughs> have I done something wrong there? I think I might have done. Yes, that's all it needs to be. So obviously the back doesn't go five high, it goes four high. But the, the ones at the side go five high. And obviously this is where your deck's going to sit. So uh, yes, I think uh, we can cover that now. We can cover that and uh, proceed with the, the next bit. So that's been covered now and we have the marking out for the next deck and and this is the last bit that we need to do within this section. So that's good. It's nothing too difficult either. So we're going to start right at the back of the ship. So where you got this middle line here. You just want to run that all the way back to that... Um, whatever it is, cargo hatch thing, whatever it is, just all the way back, just like that, nice straight line, obviously don't forget your windows either, and then we're going to come around the front of the hatch, and from the middle block, I'm going to do three, four to the right, and then four to the left, and then the third block in, six back four to the right so that's five all together and then five there and then what you're going to do you're going to take the deck out underneath and then just do this extra bit of quartz underneath so that's that so you should be able to see down to the steering gear through there and then what you're going to do is just cover that bit with slabs from that point. 
That covers that up nicely. And obviously we'll carry on with the uh, layout after this. And then you can leave a sign on it saying steering gear trunk. So that's that sorted now. So back on with the layout now. So from the left here you got a door there and then you got four and then three back and then a door and then two and then four to the left one to the right there and then two back a door and then two five to the left and then you've got a door there one two three four five and then a door there and then from that bit there just above the staircase you're just going to do another wall bring that up by four I guess obviously there's going to be a wall across there as well like I was trying to say before <laughs> so I'll just bring this up there we go and then fill this top bit in and I like to fill the, the next block down in as well, just so it's not so tall. <clears throat> and obviously this just leads down to the uh, the steering gear. So that's that. Right. So just a bit left to deal with now. Steward accommodation. There was a lot of steward accommodation on this ship. So you've got a door there. And then you want four then three back and then one there a door sorry then two four to the right one there and then two back a door three back six to connect up to the wall there four back there And a one block gap and then you want another four and then obviously there's going to be a staircase there and you've got a door there and then just one there so uh yes we'll uh, pretty much build this up now and then i'll give you uh, another show around and uh we'll see what's what after that so just a quick show around now um it is mostly beds in fact i think it's all beds so yeah, so you got your staircase here, and then some beds in here, and uh, it's pretty much beds in every room. <laughs> so it's nice and simple this part, obviously don't forget your windows as well. I am just leaving you to do your own windows because they're not historically accurate, and uh, yes, it just all adds to the time in the tutorial if I've got to show the windows as well. So just don't be forgetting to put them in and you'll be fine. Obviously that's your staircase. Obviously just do the wood panelling around it and uh, you'll be fine. Just like that. But you probably know how to do the staircases by now. Even if you haven't seen any of my other tutorials, you've done enough in this tutorial to probably know what you're doing by now. So uh, yeah, that's it. So part 29, obviously we will be continuing from the back of the ship, but you can just cover this bit up now and that's that bit up to height. So uh, yes, that is it for today. If you have any problems, let me know in the comments and I will get back to you as soon as I can. I hope to catch you in part 29 and thank you for watching.